What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Equal Espresso, and welcome back to another Black Ops 3 video here today on the channel. Today, we got some absolutely awesome news for you PC users and for people that may want to get into the PC version here just because, well, there's a lot of stuff coming on the horizon. For those that do not know, a long while back, right after the launch of Black Ops 3, it was announced that mod tools would be coming to Black Ops 3 sometime around April here, in which we'd be getting an announcement for when it would be live and whenever we could actually see some progress on it. Well, it's not live at the very moment, but there is a massive update here within this. We know that Treyarch has been working tremendously hard on this here over the past couple of months because, well, it's still been in the shadows. We haven't heard really relatively too much about it, but the alpha for mod tools is now live. So does this mean that you can just jump into Steam, open up Black Ops 3, and open up a map editor? Not necessarily, but it is incredibly big news because this has been something that a lot of people were saying it might not even come because we haven't heard anything on it here. A lot of people, including myself, got a little bit worried that because it's getting closer to the end of April and that initial projected date of when we could see some announcement here for it, that it wouldn't be coming at all. So that's something that we no longer have to worry about. This is something that is totally big. It's going to allow us to make maps, game modes, anything really in between here and play it as a community for community servers. So this alpha is a closed alpha that is invite only. There are certain people in the community that have gotten invites here to it. Some people probably randomly, some people chosen by Activision and Treyarch themselves, simply because, well, they know the game best and they know how to do this stuff. But with that being said, when can we all see something here coming into this? When will this be open to the public? That's the big question now here within this. In their official press release on this, it says that it's our intention to kick off the subsequent open beta stage of testing in the following month. So with that being said, anywhere in the next couple of months is up for grabs here. I think it's going to be something that the beta is going to take place right in between DLC 3 and 4 where it gets that ready and then it will actually be live for everybody in the full completed phase after DLC 4 so that if people are not wanting to play the DLC they have something to fall back on but it also in a marketing standpoint doesn't take away from people buying DLC 4 because if there's a lot of creatable stuff that you can do and make your own stuff that's definitely going to take the appeal from something that's already been pre-made away just a little bit but that also gears up for COD 2016 if a lot of people are not in favor of it, well, they have a limitless amount of opportunities to create stuff that they do like and to implement it and utilize better tools here than, say, World at War and the mods over there. Black Ops 3 is, of course, obviously a better graphical and updated game, so it's something that would definitely be nice to bring all these mods up to speed with the current dates. Now, for those that are interested in how this actually looks, what it's going to look like within the mod tools, I'll leave a link down there in the description below to a video of a guy showing off a little bit of this. He got invited to the early out so he has some footage here up on his YouTube channel. Hopefully it's still up by this point. I'm not entirely sure if that infringes on any copyright or not. So if it doesn't, it'll still be there. But if the link is gone, then that might be an explanation as to why. But that's what I have this video up here today, ladies and gentlemen. Let me know what you think down there in the comment section down below. Are you guys stoked for mod tools? I know I'm definitely pumped here because that's going to open up so much in terms of content here for Call of Duty Black Ops 3. But I'd love to hear your thoughts down there in the comment section down below. Leave a like down below if you did enjoy it. If you guys are new to the channel, Make sure you subscribe. We're on the road to 30,000 subscribers, so every little bit does help. And as always, greatly appreciate it. But, Monotony Cool Espresso, I'll see you guys later. Take care and peace.